Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. What I'd like to do is show you how to uh, solve this absolute value equation. Uh, now, again, when we're solving an absolute value equation, we set up two solutions, two cases, right? Um, one where we have our absolute value is equal to a positive or to a negative number. Now, when we think about that, absolute value of x ha is always going to equal x, and the absolute value of negative x is always going to equal x. Well, the important thing to notice is it always equals a positive value, right? That's the absolute value. It's, it's always positive. So in this case, I have I isolated, or my absolute value is isolated, but we're saying the absolute, that the absolute distance is negative. Well, that's impossible. So therefore, there is no solution. There is no number I can plug in for x that's going to, that when I take the absolute value of that expression, it's going to be negative. Because the absolute value of any number, positive or negative, is always going to be positive. So therefore, whenever you have an absolute value equal to a negative number, you can just stop what you're doing and just write no solution. Thanks.